Hi everyone! Mike, mm. did you know that my family owns a chicken farm? Hmm, uh, yes, but why did you bring that up right now? We're starting a video. I know! It's because of egg number six. Okay, uh, let's open it up and what's in it? We're opening the egg, I'm so excited! <laughs> it has Ooh. a feather huh. in it. Oh. A feather? Yes. And you're talking about chickens. Uh, wait, I get it. It's the night that Jesus is taken before the council. The night that Peter betrays him. Am I right? I'm right, aren't I? You are absolutely yes. right. All right. Before Jesus went to the garden, he told the disciples they would run away, right? Mm -hmm. Well, Peter told him, no way. I'll die with you. Mm. Jesus looked at him that day and said, before the rooster crows tonight, you will deny me three times. After Jesus was arrested, they took him to the house of the high priest so that they could find evidence against him. Which is funny, because shouldn't they have done that before they arrested him? Mm. They brought all sorts of people in to lie about Jesus, but they couldn't use any of their testimonies mm. until someone said, he said he was able to destroy the temple and rebuild it in three days. Yeah. Of course, that wasn't exactly true. Jesus wasn't actually talking about the temple. He was talking about himself. Mm -hmm. He would die and rise again the third day. But no one understood that. Mm -hmm. The high priest called for a vote. What's your verdict? Guilty, they shouted. He deserves to die. Meanwhile, Peter had followed them when they brought Jesus to the house at a distance really far back. And when they got to the house, Peter sat in a courtyard around the fire with other people. Have you ever made a really big mistake? Mm. Something for which you were sure you could never be forgiven? <sighs> well, heads up, Peter's about to be there. As Peter sat around the fire, people began to notice him. One person said, you were with Jesus. And Peter said, I don't know what you're talking about. Then another person said, but weren't you with Jesus? And Peter said, nope, I don't even know him. And then another person, you must be one of them. I can tell you're from Galilee by your accent. And Peter replied, a curse on me. If I'm lying, I don't even know the man. Immediately, a rooster crowed. And Peter remembered that Jesus had said, before the rooster crows, you'll deny three times that you know me. Peter went away weeping. <laughs> now you would think this is the end of Peter's story. But God, our favorite two words, had another idea. Yes, he did. After the resurrection, Jesus forgave Peter his denials. Yeah. Jesus asked Peter three times, do you love me? And three times Peter replied, yes, you know that I love you. Peter went on to be one of the greatest yeah. leaders of the church. The next time you make a big mistake, remember Peter. Jesus will forgive you if you say, sorry, I won't do that again. That's the end of the video for this egg. Thanks for watching. Bye, everyone. Bye. Seriously, a beard? Uh-huh. <laughs>